high. Why do we have to kick our door? Stop kicking the door. Yeah, stop kicking your door. Stop kicking this door. Stop kicking all the doors. You started kicking your door at 6.30 a.m., Beckham. 6.30. Then you started kicking this door at 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock, 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock. Daddy has his alarm set for 12. You wrecked my sleep, son. I need the keys. I gotta go potty. Mommy has the keys. Come on, let's go. Out, let's go. You're asking for TJ and friends, but every day I come in here, this is on here. Did you, did you not know how to do this anymore or something? This is your TV. My TV? My TV. Search TJ and friends. There you go. Now you can go back to all your videos. It takes forever to click on it. He's been doing this on purpose, though, for attention. There you go. There you go. Look, it's on now. Okay? No, we don't want, no, we don't want to try premium. We're good. There you go. Brody Beckham, this is what you asked for, right? Kicking the door, just like yesterday. Same thing. Get that lid and that lid. Now he's asking for Monsters Inc. now. Because that was our routine. The hard drive's not working, Beck. I don't know what to tell you, Beckham. This is what we're putting on. You asked for it. Okay, thank you. Give me the other red one. This mattress thing was in the hallway. Again, you're going to fall down those stairs. It's going to be bad. Let's go downstairs. Uh, you can do this all you want. Monster Zink doesn't work on here anymore. You have Monster Zink. I know mom will put Monster Zink on downstairs for you. Come on. Okay, again, it's that. I didn't get what I want routine thing. Okay. See you downstairs. Oh, DJ Brody falls sleepy. That was the last set of batteries for that. <laughs> They're all gone now. Okay, we don't want to wake Brody up, okay? Let's let Brody sleep. A lot of the regular channels actually come in a little bit. We want sleepy Brody. All right, Barry Benson, okay. You're telling me Barry Benson now. You want me to put Barry Benson on? Barry Benson. Okay. Because you just turned Barry Benson off. I'm curious. I said Monsters, Inc. Barry Benson. Okay, we're going there. He was on. You turned him off. What about Monsters, Inc.? Back on. Yeah, what happened to Monsters, Inc.? There you go. Barry Benson. We'll start it all over. Barry Benson. There we go. Ooh, not that loud. There we go. Barry Benson is on. Mom's in control and so is brother. Okay. Let's go. Let's go do race car boom. You're tired. He's saying Monsters Inc. TJ and Friends. All kinds of... You look exhausted. What's the opposite? You woke up at 2 in the morning, 4 in the morning, 6, but you weren't kicking the door till 7 on those 6.45, but he's tired. Relax. It's 5, it's 4 o'clock. Just take it easy. Yeah, we're going to do race car boom, okay? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's no big deal. Daddy's cleaning up. We'll figure everything out. What's going on with you? Still the there? Last I know, but we already, we already resolved all that. Let's see what we Race car boom it is, is we set up some buffalo chicken crock pot. This right here, what's this? Stop turning it on. This is no, yeah, so stop turning it on. There's nobody up there. Stay away from this. I still got to fix that from when you pulled it out. I can't even open that down properly. What is it? Race car boom. Race car boom it is. For you, sir. You got your troll, as he says. It's controller. Mm -hmm. Controller. Can you say controller? Tro Controller. Controller. Er. er. There you go. Good job. All right, what are you at right here, son? 309. Oh, my goodness. And he didn't even eat anything yet. We're going to do it up here. Okay, go ahead. You can start eating. Let's do five. Brave boy, we forget. We don't need to go downstairs for all. We just bring it all with us up here, okay? You're brave boy. You're a little high, so let's give you five. You're going to eat the... Jesus. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good job. You did it up here. Now enjoy your Jesus. Good job, Beckham. You're so brave. There you go, my cheese it man, right from the box. Good job. It's about, there's about this much in there. So it should be good. Oh, Beckham took over. Look, he's driving now. Yeah, Beckham, you driving? Oh, you're going in reverse, huh? Woo! Go, Beckham, go! We said we done for the day of this. <laughs> I gotta bring up that Nintendo Wii and Nintendo 64, get like a little table and stuff playing on it, because 
Don't touch daddy's glasses now. No. No daddy's glasses. But he was having fun. We gotta get you into like Mario Brothers, bro. We gotta get the Wii U out of the garage and up here. We gotta my do it when you're not here, though, because that's a whole thing. We're worth a hook of wires behind that TV and moving it. Yeah, because then we can go out there easier, because I don't want that to get wrecked. This PlayStation keeps overheating. Next thing you know, that's gonna be wrecked. We'll get it. We got it. Very chill sort of day. Let's 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 turn this off. Let's go do some other things here. Like, I don't know, feed ourselves more? I don't I'm hungry. Aren't you hungry? Always you can eat. You're so confused about Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day is only one day a year, buddy. You keep saying school tomorrow, Valentine's Day. School tomorrow. No school tomorrow. You have off tomorrow. Let's bring all this down too. Before I bring this down, oh man, this is so destructive. What are you doing over here, child? Jesus. Beckham, you gotta stop doing this, buddy. This is no. You, you know, you don't want to have no mattress. So we'd have to go get you another one right away. You, know, you gotta stop doing this stuff. Like, this is no. Leave the mattress in one spot, guys. Don't wedge it, push it. Leave this over here. Look, see this right here? Yeah, this is still playing. So it was, it was you that was doing it on purpose. As well as kind of thought you weren't able to watch it on there. Right? No. All this stuff has to be washed tomorrow. Today we'll, we'll survive one more day, but we'll wait till the day before school since you have off. This is now. No, this is clean. This is yes, kids. Don't mess it up. Uh, we can't have lights off at 7 o'clock and Brody's over here asleep still. Since when we saw him three hours ago. He's been napping down here with mom the whole time. Hey, there he is. Hey, Brody boy. Hi, how you doing there? Dinosaur man, DJ Brody. You look so handsome. DJ Brody with his little chinny chin chin. Wake up, Brody. You can't be uh, going there doing all that all night here. Come on, man. Just want to eat. No school tomorrow. All right, while you're doing your rocking, I'm waking Brody up over here. Ha <laughs> ha, you get ha ha. Wake up, Brody. Brody, it's too late to be sleeping. We need you on schedule. Boom, 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 Hey, your turn. Hey. Come on, your turn. Here. Give me some drum in here. Yeah, come on, baby boy. Play me some drums. Come on. Come on, baby boy. You can't be asleep this late at night. You'll be up until 2 in the morning. Here, Beck, play the drums. Beck, play drums. Hey, here. Here, you play. I want to hear you play. Play the drums here. Come on, give me a beat. Give me a beat. Let's keep Brody awake. We got the music playing. We got, yeah, boom, boom, boom. Go ahead. Get off him. Get on him. Keep playing. We got to wake Brody up. He needs to be awake. There he is. Look, he's starting to stretch. He says, I know. I know the key to your heart. Fruit snacks. You want fruit snacks? He's happy. He's a sleepy boy. Because your brother and you were up in the middle of the night. I heard you in there goofing off and laughing and running around. Ugh. All right, party animals. I want the light on. Light's got to be on, though. We got to get Brody up, okay? How about we pick up some Legos over here? At least put them all in the corner. I mean, I don't care if you don't, but. Only you got no swim on. Okay, that'll start for you. Put them all over there in this corner here. I'll do it with my feet. Oh, he's doing it again. Oh, oh, oh boy, he's doing it. Oh, he's doing it. I love you. His turn again, right? You look tired too. He's going to be wide awake. You're going to be asleep early. Do, 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 do. Let me, let me do it. I'll make you bounce. I'll do what I want. <laughs> I can rock all I want. Oh, poor Mickey. What about you, man? You want to give him a big hug? He says, man, I love you. I love you, Brody. I love you. I love you. Give me hugs, love. Just can't have you sleeping any longer, so you've been sleeping since like 2 o'clock. All right, there's a little better. This is yes, back. Looks like we're missing a lot. Right all under the couch here. This one's still going back to sleep on me here. I can't have that. All right, let's do a little laundry here because we're going to have to do all their other blankets and stuff later tomorrow. A nice uh, pre-soak is uh, necessary here. Max it out. Man, I really get rid of the stinkiness that's on them things. Let's put away these groceries, Mom. Yeah, Mama. Come on, Brody boy. We got everything ready to go. He's just, you know, he doesn't want to come. He's a wave Come on. You want these? Let me change you at least. Come on. Here. Sorry, I know you're tired. 
I gotta get you up here, buddy. You're gonna be soaking through this couch in a moment here. Oh, there's some more Legos. Come down this way. Come on. Here's a smile. Come on, geek. <laughs> he knows what he's doing. Can we turn the lights back on, back? You can have these if you like. Yeah, wake up, man. You guys both need shower. Bad, bad. We're gonna wait it out till tomorrow though, before school. Dad's gonna get one of the I really do one. No duties. All right, we got you. Ooh, what the heck happened to this camera? We're gonna eat them at the table though. Come on, come sit at the kitchen counter. We're not gonna go back to the corner of the couch and lay down and fall back asleep. All right, baby boy, they're right there. What do you want them? He's just like, you know what? I gotta get you spaghetti. You want some spaghetti? All right, come on back. We gotta do Dr. Birdie. Your spaghetti's done here. Good job. Come on, Birdie boy, come eat. Come on, you haven't eaten since like noon, bro. It's like eight o'clock. Mom says you've been on that couch for four plus hours now sleeping. That's what you guys get when you wake up in the middle of the night. This is brothers. If you're hungry, you let me know now. Now's your chance. Forever hold your peace. Don't eat his fruit snacks, though. Oh, you want the cuddly guy? Okay, good. That's good. All right, let's do this. Come on, I see you moving. Come on, let's guide you over here. Come on, big boy. Let's make you even a bigger, bigger, stronger big boy here. I pick you up. Come here. Oh, no, you want to do it this way? There you go. Go eat. I know your butt's hungry. I can eat it not be. Eight hours without eating. That's oh, and then he just takes them and runs back to the couch. Okay, we try. I'm just gonna work on this more. So he's like, Daddy hat when I put this on, Daddy hat. Yeah, buddy, Daddy gotta get a haircut just like you. That's why I'm, I feel like I need a shower because my hair's all greasy. Better from this hat too, putting it on, sweating. I'm not sweating. Yum, 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 yum. <laughs> you gotta get all this hair out of your eyes. You can't see your faces anymore. It drives me crazy every time I'm like seeing videos. I'm like, man, where's your face at? Especially, uh, like right now, your hair went all dirty. Yes, yeah, I was good. Okay, let me do this for you. There you go, brave boy. And then this is it for you. I mean, it's up to you. You guys can stay up late. I hope you do. So you stop getting up at 6 o'clock, 7 in the morning. <laughs> 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, Brave boy, you did it again. Muscles, show your muscles. Muscles, go. look at those muscles. Oh. Upside down nose. Oh. Okay, you go back to doing your rocking. Just get that done. That's very important. You calling it a night? Lights out? Lights out? All right, my man. You do you, bro. I ain't going to complain about that. Why well, clean up over here? Let's go. We've been doing a 24-hour insulin like right around this time now, around 8 o'clock. What are you saying quack, quack for? What are you looking for? Come on, I got to go potty. Come on. I, if, do you want to eat or not? Do you want to eat? I don't think you do. You just ate like a half a box of Cheez-Its. Come on, let me get everything settled here. Love this routine. All I gotta do is say, put your pull-ups on, and he does it. Good job, Beckham. You're the man. Hey, let me take your dirty undies. Get them stinky things out of here. And remember, you put the pants and everything back on, okay? Okay, good job. You did it, blue in the back. The pants are inside out, but that's okay. Still have to keep fixing that second diaper, but that's, you know, he doesn't really need to have two, but at nighttime, it's safety precaution with all the messes. You're good, though, right? I can go potty now and get a shower. Everybody's good. They're gonna lock everything. How you doing, drummer man? Brody's going to say lights back on, which is fine. We'll go back and forth with it. Oh, you just want to do that, huh? The fruit snack's inside there. All right, Daddy's going to go potty and get like a 10-minute shower. I'll be back in like 10, 15 minutes, okay? You kids be good boys, please. This is no, stand in the windows. This is yes. Remember, your food's on the table, on the counter, Brody. Come eat. I know he wants to eat. They're just going to go back and forth with the lights on. It's okay. You can turn it on, bro. That's between you and him. <laughs> Funny how there's like a switch on each side. They'll do this like back and forth. All right. Be a good boy, please. If you got to use the potty at bed, use this one right here. He's saying potty because he wants to do the, the, light, the light thing from looking through the windows. Now, no, we're not going in here. You said potty. Daddy's trying to get situated to go in there. Go potty. Go ahead, go. You say you got to go potty after we just put the diapers on you and everything. You could have did that the minute before that. Let me fix him again. He didn't have to go. He just tried to and nothing came out. So that was all show just to get to go do the bacon. Like I said, down there. And he still wants to do this too. So I'm going to get them. Maybe not. Let's try it done. Back on you being good boy. Good boy. Okay, good. Hopefully Brody is too. Hi, Brody. How you doing, man? I'm sorry, but it's too late for water play, my man. I know that's what you want right now, but we can't do that. Mm -hmm. All right, we're going back down. Ah, you're being such good boys. 
watching your videos, being good boys. Look, you're wearing the same clothing, huh? Look at that. What are the chances of that? You're wearing the same outfit, huh? Let me guess, Brody's in the same green too, watch. What are the chances? We'll see, is it Brody in green? What are the chances here? Oh, we might have missed it already. Where's Brody at? Where's Brody Beckham? Is he in his green? Is Brody wearing green? I'm curious. Oh, there we go. We got to see Brody. Is he wearing green? Oh, he is. He's wearing green. Look at you wearing the same stuff. Look at your kids. Oh, look at that Stevie bathroom. Oh, yeah. Good job, boys. Oh, he's dead today. I don't see the tray. I'm assuming the tray is upstairs in the bedroom. Of spaghetti he probably ate it all. Kids, not only do you guys need haircut, the daddy needs a haircut. We need to do this all together, man. Got to get mommy to get a friend over here. Oh, you like watching these videos, huh? They're cute. You cute, man. That's when you cover up daddy's ugly face, yep. You silly boy. Now, you're going to fall asleep first. Your brother's going to be up until 12 o'clock at night. I don't have to deal with you kids. Yeah, I know, you're tired already, because you've been up since 6 o'clock in the morning, and then you're up at 2, 3, I mean, you're up throughout the middle of the night. Yeah, I don't know what to do with you. There's no school, so you guys are running around here till like, 11 o'clock at night. I'm going to go say, Daddy, take your vitamins. You guys didn't get yours today. I'm sorry about that, but I wasn't down here. We'll make up for it tomorrow. It's too late now. Take your vitamins, Dad. You're being good boys. Okay, you're being a drummer man. Eating your pasta, okay, I see you. Good job, Brody. Just yes, you do your thing. Just please don't dump any water on this thing. It's wrecked. Let's cover him up and let him lay down here for a little while. It's so early. Let me go, baby. Let me cover up his feet. I just don't wear no socks, man. I don't wear no socks, stink, man. Hey, he's sound asleep. It's because he's waking up in the middle of the night. It's ridiculous. Hopefully, he'll wake up in half hour, hour. Oh, there you go. You're being a good boy. Yeah, good boy. Lay down. You're good. I covered you up, blanket. Yeah, get nice and cozy. There you go. There you go. Much better than sleeping up in the mattress right now, anyway. All right. I'll be back. Put the temp up again. No school tomorrow. I'm getting up at six. He's gonna still get up early as well. But I'm gonna see if I can work with him tonight on and off until like eleven. All right. It's nine thirty. I got the keys. I gotta stir that buffalo chicken up. I can't just see how they're doing. They're being good boys, they're watching our videos. How cozy. Uh, Brody went and got his uh, blankie too. How you doing? Hey, you watching your movies? You watching your movies? You look exhausted. Do you want to go to bed or you want to stay down here? Here, let's cover those piggies up. Cover those piggies up. Keep them nice and warm. Okay, you look exhausted back. But. And I'll let you lay down here as long as you want. Oh, let me turn this off, Brad. See if you'll fall asleep. Put the heat back up again. 71. Keeps going down to 69. I gotta change all the settings. All right, boys. I'm gonna go stir up this buffalo chicken. I'm sure mom wants some too. Let's break it all up here. Should be able to. All right, there we go. I'm gonna let it sit on low. It'll probably taste better the later it goes in there. And tomorrow will be even better. Brody, you want some more fruit snacks? Some more water? Come on, I see you running back and forth with the cup. Come on, come here. Here, let me fill it with you, for you. Just don't dump it on the DJ equipment, okay? You gonna sing me a song here? Sing me a song. Where's my song? All right, what about this? I'm gonna be a nice little song here. He's like, nah, just give me those fruit snacks there. There you go, that, and a refill. Enjoy. We'll try, we'll try at 10, 10, 30. Put this back on high, actually. We need to get more moisture out of there. It's 10, 10. Let's get it back up at least. Look, Brady's up there. Then they're both going up. Want your gummies, homie? How about them gummies, baby boy? What you think, Beck? Hey, you want your gummies? Come on, let's go. Let's go. Bedtime. Come on. TV off. Look, we're doing gummies here too. Isn't that crazy? Look, Brody's asleep. That's like you. Same thing. Timing right there, baby boy. Let's get you up to bed, okay? You took your water cup. You got four water cups. Let me get your gummy. Two equals five again. Thank you, Andy, and the, the videos you sent me. Baby boy, you look so sleepy. Come here. Come here, baby boy. Come on, let's get these. There you go. Take two of those. Call me in the morning. There is no school tomorrow. I'll put ours in here. 
Give these to Brody. Oh, Brody got a whole lot of pasta down here. Cool. Brody's probably not going to go up. We'll try, though. I'm going to put this up here. If he doesn't go up or whatever, he's got to be hungry, man. There he is. Come on, Brody. Come back down. Go ahead. Come on. Here. Here's your pasta. Come eat. Can I have one of these cups for brother? Okay. Here, go do your thing. I'm going to let you watch TV, okay? Do you want to go to bed? You want to go uh, up? Come on. Okay. That doesn't help. Okay, Beck. I'm coming. We'll take care of you in a minute, Brody. We're we'll worried about Beckham first. What you need, son? Oh, he took the pillows and everything. At least the sheet's still on. You want the remote? Okay, I got to go get the pillows. Oh, where they are. Here. Here. How about you just worry about going to bed? Wouldn't that be a good thing to do? I'll be right back. Stay up here. Oh, there's those pillows. Oh, my drummer man. All right, you're staying up a little bit. Let's bring these up. I'll be right back. We'll put TV on for you, okay? Lots of stink. There's your pillow. Let's buy this pillow. Here, lay down. Go ahead, lay down. Get your blanket. Lay down. Hey, here, put this on you. You need a blankie. You need a blankie? Yeah. No? Okay. What do we say before bed? I love you, sweet dreams. You are already having sweet dreams. Get some sleep, homie. You watch your videos, go to bed. Brother's gonna stay up a little longer. Brody slept for four hours today, buddy. He's wide awake. Okay, we'll be back. Get some sleep. No, 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 you don't need to take that sheet off. Do you want a sheet? Hold on. Yeah, here. There's one up here. Here, here's a sheet. He doesn't like the blankets. So, well, this sheet's an option, I get it. All right, baby boy. I love you. Get some sleep, okay? Sleepy boy, sleep it off. Please do not kick the door in the morning. If you need daddy or mommy in the morning, go like this, you go. Hello, I'm awake in the morning, okay? No kicking door. You know the deal. I love you. See you in the morning. All right, Mr. Brody. Oh, Mr. Drummer Man, Mr. DJ, Mr. Spaghetti Eater. I kind of figured you still want to eat that. Let's uh, put your, uh, let's put the monster stink on. Show me your drum skills as you eat that spaghetti as I find monster zinc. We're gonna put a Monsters Inc., Monsters University, Monsters at Work, everything on that little flash drive. We got 64 gigabyte. The one that's plugged in the TV is only 16. So that should do the trick. I thought about getting a bigger external hard drive. They don't need that. You can get like a good year out of that little flash drive. The one that's up there is 15 years old and it's still working. So, all right, let's find it here. Monsters Inc., right? Monsters Inc., you haven't spoken in a while, buddy. Where's Daddy? Daddy, drummer man. I might have to change it one more time. We'll see how that goes. I'm hoping you do poop and not in the morning, in the middle of the night. Oh, oh, look at him drumming. Air drummer. Ooh. All right, let's go. Monsters Inc. takes forever to push the button on this thing. All these remotes are messed up from the kids, man. They really did a number on a lot of these remotes. All right, we'll start it over. You're in control now, okay? You let me know when you're sleepy. I love you. Have fun. Daddy will be up for a while, okay? You got a good couple hours if you need do 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 All right, I'll be back in 15 minutes. Hopefully he goes there and see. We got to get more moisture out of here. We need to stay thick. He's the teammate of the month. Whether it was last month or this month, I don't care. He's always the teammate of the month up here. Is there anything else I can do for you, sir? You good? You're good, right? I don't know where your water cup went. It's probably, oh, there it is. Sorry, we dropped it. Keep a little water. Just enough to hydrate and more ice. Because we don't need them dumping it on that DJI equipment. DJ equipment. I'll leave the water here. You do your thing. I'll be back. I'll be back wide awake. So much energy. I'll put these... Uh, here, he won't see these and if he finds them needs them good well no i'll be back be good boy okay he will always he's always good 
sure yesterday's video too now we're at that point it's quarter to 11 let's check on the probes to he's upstairs of course he is in the hallway right brody boy you ready for bed Brody boy, what you doing, man? What you doing, man? You just dancing in the hallway. What you need, son? Come on. You want something else to eat? What you need? Well, we ain't going out there. Absolutely not. No, that's not good. You want to go in here? Have another fruit snack pack. Okay. <laughs> I got to check the laundry, baby boy. Come on. Here's your time to capitalize on the laundry and get yourself a fruity snack. I'm trying to make it a lot more for you. Oh, it's still going. Let's grab another fruit snack. Sugar, wear them out. Oh, no, the kid loves them. Hey, look what I got, happy boy. Come on, what you setting up a little uh, area here to sleep in the hallway? You ever get tired? Woo, Woo I wish you didn't sleep four hours today. How's this doing? Yeah, it's a boy, it's a sizzling in this. Come to me, fruit snack man. Is that where you're going to sleep tonight? What are you going to do here? There you go. Eat them up. You got 15 minutes. I'm going to try to get you up to bed, okay? As you dance in the hallway. All right. I was grabbing it here. It's 11.03. Yeah, man. That's what a four or five hour power nap will do to you today, son. I'm assuming you're going to sleep in tomorrow and your brother's going to be up at 7 o'clock in the morning here kicking doors. All right. Pump them. While I make my lemon water, sugar rush. Hopefully I don't have to hear bing bangs and make my lemonade, lemon water. I usually use about one of these for a gallon. Uh, very beneficial to the belly health, the body, heart, everything. Oh, the laundry done, let's do it. All right, boiling the water and the sugar. Brody boy, what's it gonna be like when you're a teenager, man? This is gonna be like you when you only need like eight hours of sleep a night. Your kids are all about the energy. Yeah, ay, 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 ay. This is dumb. We're just gonna throw all this down here for now. Never really showed the kids this. You wanna get all this lint out of here, kids. So it has to go. See all this back and we scrape it off, put it in the trash. And you put it back in. Pretty sure we're living his best life, dancing around the hall. See that? We take all that out of there. Then we take this and put it in the trash. Then we fold this man. I know it's hard to do. You know, it's just boring crap. But the kids learn. They really do learn from this. It's pretty amazing, man. Boom. Then we take this. We're going to put it in there. Again, the, 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 the max is 139, I believe. I got two blankets in here. So we got to do that. Here you go, kids. Time dry. Help your parents. All the kids that watch their parents. Yo, help your parents, please. Here you go. Start. Look at that. Oh, spinning. Spinning. You good? You have until this movie's over by 12 or earlier? It's up to you, my man. You're being a good boy. All right. I'll be back. You got outfits for tomorrow with your stinky butt. Mr. Mr. Fruit Snack Man. DJ Brody. Yeah, pop it on. See you later. All right, we're all locked back up. Lock, 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 lock. Come on, stink man. Let's go. Here's this. I don't smell any duties. Eat those. Let's get you to bed, homie. It's 11.30. Uh, 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 uh. No, come on, Brody boy. Come on, it's time for bed. All right, this is the end. The end. Come on. Mom's letting the kitties out. It's time to go to bed. I gave you to almost 12. Come on, let's go. Come on, get down. Brody, come on, baby boy. See you later. Come on, let's go. Give me your hand. Give me your hand. Please give me your hand. Let's go. <sighs> yep, yeah, mm -hmm. let's go. Want your water? Get your water cup. Let's go. Spaghetti eating it up. Okay. Let's go, homie. Get your blanket. 
All right, yeah. Come on, let's go. Let's go up. It's time. Gotta eat all that crap off the carpet. No good. Love you, sweet dreams. Get some sleep. No school tomorrow. Yeah, go to bed, baby boy. Come on, it's almost midnight. It's time. I'll be up till two in the morning. Easy cleanup. Cats crap on every day. They poop on that's amazing. I can't wait to be woken up at 6 30 by Beckham. Open that for mom. Has everything else is combination except for this. Open that for mom. Good. You don't know what you're talking about, Zebra. Just some of the supplements before I end this vlog. As I prepare for the end of this rant, so, say people can ask me about my supplements. So let's just let's let's dig into that as well. It's cold. Just waiting for the uh, Roku to like deliver the uh, screensaver here, so it's brighter here. <laughs> ah, screw it. It's taking way too long. But anyway, uh, good day with my boys as always. The past couple of days, I apologize for not doing my ending. That is therapeutic for myself and sometimes others. You guys have said we, we missed that. Ever just just two emails. Like, we missed your little end rant. And I was like, what, really? <laughs> I was too tired, man. It's awesome. Anytime you don't get an ending rant there, it means it's like, it was an even better day because I'm just like, I'm tired, smooth. Like, man, I'm going to go out here and just uh, start uh, having my drinks and uh, chain uh, CIGs. <laughs> I was getting real talk, man. But a lot of you have been asking me about, besides you see me drink that lemon juice every day, as somebody with an implantable defibrillator, I know it's, I'm not a doctor, okay? But it's like your body knows what your body needs. Uh, and even if you don't have a heart condition, I'm saying this is one of the number one things I will ever recommend here. As, as I mean, if you are a S-M-O-K-E-R, I have to spell it out because I don't want any more nonsense here. The COQ10 is crucial here, okay? I mean, you can get anywhere from 400 milligrams a day. I mean, I was only doing 100 milligrams a day. As now there's a big company that does it. I forget what they're called, but like Tony Hawk's their sponsor. And it like, it blew up. I mean, I've been doing this for like 15, 10 to 15 years from now. 10, 15 years ago. It delivers more oxygen to your heart. Now, whether you have a heart condition or not, it's it's very beneficial. And then we're gonna go with the other one here. We're gonna nerd talk. This. That's my kids take it as well, the gummy form. What's it? Elder battery? Well, I can't even think. Oh hold on, I can't see right now. Hold on, put my glasses on her. Her on children, hold on. I forget what it's called. It's basically like blackberries, but it's not. Black elderberry. Crucial. Take these. I'll take them two or three times a day with the suggested amount. But then anytime when you're eating late at night, oh, we're about to switch over to the, oh, there we go. This is, I was trying to explain to their mom. She's always on diet plans all the time. Like, I was like, I've been on the same diet as I eat whatever I want. Just take my supplements, my vitamins, and now protein shakes. I can do whatever I want. Get a pound here and there. It's just less eating but like i had two steaks <laughs> chicken wings tuna fish garbage chicken noodle soup but in a can that has so much sodium in them if you take one of these before you go to bed to fortify pre-probiotics it will lessen all the bloatingness in you and i actually had uh drinks out here so like you gotta find that balance and then for all the 
awful people out there like myself that like to, you know, S-M-O-K-E, whether you, you do the W-E-E-D, <laughs> whatever else I do not, this is a natural cleanse for your lungs. You really got to get on this stuff, man. Vitamin B12, 5,000 milligrams. And some will say, as I have friends that are doctors and nurses, like it's unnecessary to take more than one a day. But if you're in the process of actually having those SMOKEs and your D-R-I-N-K-E-S, have it during that, it's not going to hurt. As long as I do the potassium and the vitamin C during that. It's just a little work around here. I'm not saying it's perfect, but like I would suggest just quit all that other garbage that we do. But like, if you can't, there you go. And then this one was one of my favorite here. I just found this out like this past couple months. This, this right here. As I looked into it more, this is a generic brand that is online through Amazon and other stuff. They're selling this in other forms with like the collagen and other stuff. This reservoir troll, it's about $22 a bottle for about a two month supply. I've been almost doing double dose a day because your body always doesn't, you know, get all that value of it. But like, this is supposed to be a longevity pill. And they're like marketing like that. But I've noticed how much I feel better taking it, but it also burns body fat as well. I'm just like, man, I pigged out this week. And I'm like, how? I lost a pound. I'm like, how the hell am I a pound less? Because I was taking all my supplements. And that's too, the lemon juice. If you can actually do the, the natural squeeze lemon juice on Amazon, the maximum they get you, allow you to do is like 10 of these every week. Oh, I go through 40 a month. Easy. He told me, I was like, you ordered 28 of the 28 of times 10. So I was like, but it really does. It burns the body fat, but it's also good for everything in your system completely. And again, being a nerd, I'm good at this. I just saw recently somebody was saying, yeah, Joe Rogan was talking about this. Like, Dude, I've been taking these for like 10 years now. Walmart has generic versions of all that. I would go from Walmart to uh, Amazon. You take this, and then you add this to it. Because I just finished this bottle. It's in there, whole freshy, freshy. And then honestly, any other berries or anything you can get... Uh, naturally, I mean, there's there's other ones. You want to take the magnesium, the zinc, all, all that stuff, man. Just do your research. Uh, do not ever take it on an empty stomach because you'll be like, Bleh. and a lot of people, like my kid's mother, she's like, I, I don't want to swap pills. She can't swap pills. She can't, she can barely even handle getting a shot. <laughs> but I don't know. I feel great, man. So just saying, as we live in this world where the, all this stuff is available to you, take advantage of it. And I think for a good buck fifty two, maybe a buck fifty a month, you can have this full supply plus other stuff. Oh, besides the lemon juice, the lemon juice is about like it's about a hundred dollars a month. So all right, two hundred two hundred fifty dollars a month. But the water supply is garbage in New Jersey and just pretty much everywhere you go. Uh, I shouldn't feel bloated when I go to the refrigerator and I use the filtration system where I pour the water into the little canteen that I do over here at the urn uh, without adding lemon or lime, whether it's fresh or just, you know, this, like, the pre stuff. It's not bad. There's, there's nothing bad about it, but there's something really off balance here. And when I was going through the reports online, it's like, uh, the township we live in, we have some of the worst water produced in New Jersey alone. Uh, and nobody's even doing anything about it. It's just like, ah, keep stuffing your bodies full of water. If, if you're drinking a bottle of water from your fridge and like even through your filtration system and you feel bloated, you shouldn't feel like that. That may be your health situations as well, but it's more than likely the water you're drinking every day. And that sounds crazy, but like nobody's gonna tell you that. You go to your doctor. I feel crazy because every time I drink my water from my, my refrigerator that's filtered, it makes me feel bloated. He's probably like, "Let's get you full of all these drugs that you need to do." <laughs> but again, any simple basic uh, concept of my uh, 
experience to share with with your experience i would love to hear what you what you feel i know there's so much other better stuff out there but this right here i skipped this for like a month oh man that i noticed a difference like my little my hips <laughs> Uh, they started to dig out more, but just it's like damn, it's just like apparently there's companies out there selling it as an anti aging thing and just like longevity pill. And I was like, and they're selling it for like a hundred dollars. And they they mention our search on Amazon that, and you'll see what I'm talking about. You're like, what? Like seventy five to hundred dollars for the for the same amount there. That's what I mean. We're in that world where like everybody's discovering things. We're we're exchanging information so rapidly, but like you gotta like figure it out for you, and you gotta do your DD, man. You gotta do your research, man. Uh, it was like I said to the doctors when I had this whole finger thing with my kids, I'm like, and that's why my recent doctor over at the board didn't even question because the doctor exchanged information with her, so he's doing great. Miles' well, heart rate great. Just like he's one of those examples where he's doing great. And she didn't even ask me to come back to do a refill. Because she's like, he's doing great. Apparently, according to the doctor, when I went over there, when I put a hole in my finger, like a little tiny hole, or a pair in the walls so with Brody uh, banging his head in the wall, and I accidentally like, pierced my finger through, like, old nails and other stuff that were literally left in the garage around here from the household here from, like, seven years ago. Who knows? There could have been some kind of random ass micro... <laughs> bacterial organism there but I don't know, every time you go to get checked up it's it's a balance man you gotta balance your ish out man i'm not saying i'm perfect at it obviously i'm out here uh having my my rollies out here and uh having the vodka like a little bit of balance just a, you know it's it's crucial for somebody when they're trying to balance out their mental health you don't see me like I know I've been there in the past. When I go to party with people, of course. But little less is more. Um, and then some of the doctors are going there and they start prescribing other stuff and other stuff. And it's not good for you. All, everything is garbage, including the alcohol is garbage. The smokes are garbage. But if you're still struggling with that whole uh, garbage, then go with the garbage. But I'll tell you right now, every day you wake up, skip the coffee. Grab one of these. Grab one of those gallon canteens that I have right here, which you can get on Walmart for like $30. Dump basically the whole thing in there with ice and all that. Start up. I guarantee you will feel so much better. Uh, it's crazy to say, and especially friends of mine that had heart failure and stuff, and I see them, they're still struggling today. And when I would skip all the stuff, I mean, when I didn't have enough uh, finances to keep it going, Oh man, I feel like I was dying some days, and I probably could have. If I didn't have this implantable to fill there, I probably would be D E A D. This big old thing here. See that? It's a teddy. But again, just a simple conversation trying to educate others. 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 <laughs> just, just, uh, I don't know. I thought, I've, I thought this was more important than discussing my kids' behavioral patterns other than Beckham climbing on the top of the stairwell here. Uh, you saw that, like, whoa, I always thought that would be a problem. I didn't think it would be like that, though. He's just like, let me put the match on, let me start, let me open the attic, let me go, go. The boy has no sense of fear. But your boys were so well behaved and everything, and it's, it's a four day weekend. Was it uh, presidential, whatever, holiday, whatever? It's, it's John, Donald Trump and Joe Biden anti aging cream weekend. <laughs> Same tomorrow. The mom asked me, are you going to stick around? Yeah, I'll stick around. I'll take care of everything tomorrow. Give them their bass, all that stuff. Maybe not out here yet. We're still working on that. Just, just keep it cool. But, uh, yeah, they need bass bad. They got that beautiful hair, man. Like, my hair is like half their length, quarter their length. For Grace. Grace. So, man, I took a nice shower, did all that stuff. I said, hey, you kids still there? Beckham, I love Brody. He's like, I love Brody. They have such beautiful hair, but washing, it's a pain in the butt, man. But uh, anyway, we get another whole day with them tomorrow. We'll, we'll wake up, do the whole thing. I'm sticking around here tonight. We'll figure it out. And just uh, thankful to be your, your, your dad, dudes. You guys are the dudes, man. And uh, this is for your future selves. If it's ever still around, I hope the channel never gets taken down, man. The monetization is one thing, but don't ever take the channel down, man. 
uh, TJ, Dad worked really hard to keep all this realistic and what life is and what it, it takes you on this journey and stuff. I could have watered it down a lot of times. So what's what's the point of that? Why why would you hide real life? And I feel like it really benefit everybody in the long run. As is real life, because people don't see the real truth of things. I've learned through what was going on with the kids is like simple, just don't show them in diapers and just obviously not their nudity. That was accidental several times. Or they're 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 bursting when they were like a year old or under a year and the baby hammers popped out. So now it's just like I I show myself with the diaper on the side with it, like nothing. I was like, here's your diaper, here you go, here you go. Like uh, it was all about like apparently unnecessary attention towards minors, but like my debate was since when is uh attention towards autistic minors uh difficulty or just uh, just children in general like it's just people use it in a negative way uh the platform is here to, pr to protect kids and it's it's not their fault it's just they're here to protect kids and i understand it completely so people take advantage of it and it's hurtful but uh it's my responsibility as a father to keep them safe and like I keep stating before and for, and everybody knows, like, everybody knows. <laughs> As I think about my dad, he's like, <laughs> when his mom took his car, had a crew with his first Chevy. Everybody knows it's it's my car. <laughs> I can't get this, but I'm just saying, it's like, it's simplistic. It's just like, you can't keep protection uh, of an image of a human being. You have to be willing to understand that it's the mother or father's responsibility to keep keep their physical form safe. It's not your responsibility to keep an image safe because it's already happening for eyes with the AI stuff. It's it's going to get more crazier and wilder, and, and I look forward to it. Uh, it's interesting. But I'm also here to think about, like, uh, saving all these videos and all that stuff and what I can create from that where... My son's never had an opportunity to, to meet my father as he was well gone and still not my mom, even though she's still here. But like we can make a lot of interesting videos. I think it's interesting and beautiful to do that. It, and it's not real, but what is real? What is real anyway? None of this is real. I'm pretty much sure whatever we're going through today is like a simulation sometimes when I think about it. As you think about technology as it advances so highly and so quickly at a rate like AI today and then tomorrow it's it's a hundred times thousands and thousands of times more advanced the next day and you can't stop it but what I'm gonna look forward to just spending my days with my kids whether I share it with y'all or not I almost didn't post the video from yesterday i put it as unlisted i was like you know what let's make it unlisted and i was like there's still 40 people that only clicked on it because maybe just do that or just find a way to share it on a another way of doing it i don't know because i don't think some of these uh social media platforms are really prepared for that because they're still trying to protect their own ass and i get that because it's all about keeping the kids safe but it's just what, how are you gonna possibly do that with artificial intelligence involved. You're not gonna be able to. You're gonna have more problems than you can ever imagine. You're gonna have channels shut down, uh, live, like, it's problematic as all hell. Presidential elections interfere with already. As I had one of those little <laughs> voice bell things, what the hell is this? It was like a voice bell from uh, Joe Biden. It was like, hey, it's me, Joe Biden. I was like, I'll click. <laughs> it's already happening. So once you click on certain things on the internet, it just starts popping up, man. But anyway, it is what it is. I love you, my sons. I'm proud of you. You guys are advancing like crazy. You guys are the dudes. Let's, let's take this off. And just uh, enjoy every day like we can, man. Because we we are very advanced civilization, civilization here. But, but are we really? We really aren't. Um, I just I just love uh, being able to hold you in my arms, wake up with you, even with your nonsense, kicking that door and just going, hey, how are we going to do it today? I miss those days where, like, you'd fall asleep on my chest and we'd watch a movie and that was it. I, I wish we could go back to I can probably figure out that quickly for, like, late night stuff, but that really works. <laughs>
And it's not just autistic kids, it's kids in general. You know as parents get older, your kids are just like, eh, you're a dork dad, you're a dork mom, we don't want to talk to you. But anyway, stop judging, start loving, accept those as well. Just be yourself, me ouch. Uh, treat the kids the way you want to be treated as a kid. At least the best you can. Pump them up with vitamins, they don't need all this stuff. If anybody's keeping up, I, I don't deliver the, the pre or probiotics to, to Brody anymore. That was only when he was really constipated from the hard spaghetti. But I'm going to tell you right now, this right here, this crucial, and uh, just the vitamin B. There's a lot of stuff. Anything is in a gummy form, and if it's meant for adults, it's usually like you take two gummies, it's meant for an adult. Just give them one. And then they have ones that are marketed towards parents with kids, and it's like, you're gonna have to take those two, like, do your research, because they charge out the butt for the stuff, man. Just cut the doses in half. It drives me crazy, man. It's, it's all about capitalization and making money on people. Nuts. All right, buddy. Yeah, take care. I got more to say, but I don't. It's, uh, I love life the best I can, and I know it's not forever. As every day is a, a confusion, and as I get older and I go on social media and I see more and more of my friends or just even simple social, social acquaintance of mine pass away and their family members, is heartbreaking. But I just remember you're still here, you're still going. And it's not your fault that they passed away, you just got to keep going, man. I see some of y'all beat yourselves up and ask questions. I had a lot of emails about a friend of ours recently passed away. I can't keep up, man. I can't. Just like uh, good friends of mine going to funerals and stuff. And they're like, why can't you attend? Like, man, I don't even own a vehicle, dude. If I own a vehicle, I would be at every single past person that's been a part of my life. When it was very simplistic, I'd be there. But I can't even get out of this area to take my kids somewhere and plan all that. It's, it's tough, but I, I will always mourn on all the people we lost. And... I do, I miss, and, and honestly, I'm thankful too. And some people ask me for older videos, like, because I've always been a big video buff guy with recording. I think people find, I think there's nothing more beautiful when you, like, a recent memory of a brother and sister passed away, and they're like, yo, what's that memory of, like, the one you shared with me when we were down in their basement, the brother and the sister passed away because they had all this nasty stuff in their walls. I believe in their father passed away, their mother's the only one that survived. Asbestos. I was like, where's that memory? We're all in the basement. And his sister's yelling down, what are you guys doing at your party? We're like, what are we doing? And we're down there, it's like an old video from like 2003 or four. It's 20 years ago. And it's still on backed up drives or I'm backed up on Facebook and on YouTube and other areas. And it is, it's kind of really soothing to like, just hear the ones that you were friends at one time, just to hear their voice and them laughing and giving all, they're just like, <laughs> this is one of my little buddy here. I miss his name. What's it about? Kevin. He's sitting there. He's like, his sister's like yelling up the stairs. She just passed away recently. And he passed away like well over a decade. And he's like, he's like yelling at us. Like, you guys got to be quiet down there. We're just like, <laughs> it's like we were like teenagers, man. Like 15, 20 years ago. Yeah. You got to laugh about that stuff, man. So I've always thought about it. like visual videos are beautiful, man. If you can keep them and share them with the, the people that that need them and mean the most, you know. When I share all these videos with y'all and my kids in the possibility where I won't be here one day, which I know it's inevitable, I won't be here, obviously. But how long will I make it? <laughs> how, how long will I make it with all these nonsense pills? <laughs> A lot of bad habits, but uh, I don't know. That's crazy. It's crazy. I just love every bit about it and just go with the flow. So, everyone, uh, go love yourselves. And uh, if you need a nice hug, here's a virtual hug because I give my hugs to my kids every day, and I feel like they deserve even more than that, man. They deserve so much, but uh, you'll take care. Go love yourselves. I don't know. It doesn't mean much sense what I just said, but I guess you get an idea what I'm saying. 22 minutes. All right, good night. <laughs> Take care, everybody. I mean it, though. Take care of yourself, please. Please. 
keep looking out for yourself, but make sure you're looking out for your kids as well. And the others that are around you the best you can. Because it's, it's not easy to keep everybody in balance. There's no balance. There's no financial balance in the world because there's no... I'm saying because, but there's just no financial balance in the world, economic balance. So how do you imagine us to get by with a balance of uh, being around each other in all old school ways of just a family living under one roof, which I feel like that should be the way today. There should be still old ways where it's like, it's you, the woman you're with, your kids, your grandmother, your grandparents, all that stuff, and aunts, uncles, everybody lives under one roof. All right, take care, everybody.